um, stay 12 today and, and things went really well. Um, you know, they're working hard and we're doing every single thing that we possibly can to create that sense of urgency with every single possession, every single drill, every, everything they're doing. And um, we've got to understand there are a lot of little things that we can do to improve this season. And it starts with a sense of urgency and value in every possession on both ends of the floor. I did notice that. I noticed that extra little bit of commitment. You could just tell by the looks on their faces and, you know, the pop in their step. Um, that they feel more prepared headed into the year because they've worked so hard in the off season. And, you know, um, when your players are telling you nobody missed a day coach, you're like, wow, that's pretty, it's pretty impressive. Sure. Well, I think we have to be more consistent to earn that respect. You know, when you beat an Iowa State and an Oklahoma and a Baylor down the stretch, you've got to be able to do that on the road and at home. And um, it's good that they take notice of that. You know, preseason polls mean absolutely nothing. But at the same time, if you're a competitor, it's got to, got to bother you a little bit. And I think it has bothered them. And I think that they want to be consistent. We want to have a great January and even better February and a stronger finish in March. And, you know, this group has been through so many experiences that it's great to see that they're drawing from those experiences. And hopefully we're going to learn from them. Just continuing to understand it's the little things that are going to make a big difference from our spacing to, you know, just, just all the things that go in defensively from our ball pressure to sprinting to help to contesting every shot to all five rebounding, all the little bitty things, um, the efforts there. But we've got to continue to understand it's the little things that make a big difference in this league.